we're delighted to have John and Liam Liddy and Beatrice uh, Via Cañes from Spain here with us. They run the Well Poetry Festival in Spain, in Madrid for the last 10 years. And as part of the gathering 2013, they decided to bring it to Limerick. So um, a warm welcome for them and Austin Dora will play us a song to welcome them in. first gathering of the well in Madrid in 2004, the Irish representative was uh, the poet Desmond O'Grady. And in as a homage to our great local poet, I'd like to read one of the poems which he read that night called Tipperary. And I'd like to dedicate this recitation to his brother Tommy, who is here with us today. Tipperary, from the Irish Tipperary the fountain of perception or enlightenment, intelligence. It's a long way to Tipperary. It's a long way to go and various. It's a torture of twists and about turns, disillusions, disappointments. The way to Tipperary appears perennially dark with only occasional twilights. If you decide to go to Tipperary, Set out while you're young, plucky, at that age when you're bright-eyed and visions of radiant horizons, of revelation and achievement, and you know nothing of twilights or the dark. That age when all creation, all life shines clear as spring sunlight, bright as light-catching gold. When you set out, you must go alone. There are no maps of the way to Tipperary. You only your only compass is your own heart. Trust that. Some see their Tipperary clearly from the start. See it's a long road, full of daily pitfalls, a labyrinth of curious side streets, inviting guest houses, giddy with the temptations of those bogey, bogey people's trinket stalls, hokey pokey, daily thieves of eternal energy, Easy come, easy go. You've sold your soul. You've no more choice. They sell bedlam. Explore all those side streets. Enjoy your chosen rest houses. Fool with a few trinkets to learn something of the way to Tipperary. The way to Tipperary darkened with the shadows of all those who never get there anyway. Those who settled for some rest house, some casual trinket thief of time. Don't let those shadows, mumbling in their own gloom, deter or deviate you. Hold to your main road. Keep going. Once you've decided to go to Tipperary, you'll realize you no longer belong to yourself, but must keep Tipperary in your, sight, in your sights daily, although you don't see it. Purpose is all. Without your Tipperary, you too are a mere shadow at those limerick junctions of daily resolution. On the way to Tipperary, keep your eyes open for signals of direction, encouragement, that nod of understanding, comradeship, a cherishing arm on your pillow. You'll see beautiful sights on the way to Tipperary. 
man's mirage tales, imagination's monuments. You'll behold the endless vistas, panoramas of vision. Be curious about them all, for the gracious gifts they will afford you. Without them, you'd live that much the poorer. It's a long way to Tipperary, and when you get there, nothing awaits you. You'll find no road sign, no brass band and welcoming committee proclaiming you're in Tipperary and a medallion to hang around your neck. You'll find only what you brought with you in your heart. Then, what you must do is make and leave some record of what your Tipperary means to you as witness for all those behind you on their ways to their own Tipperaries. It's a long way to Tipperary, but all our hearts lie there. I'd like everybody now to sing along with Austin on this one.